Hi, it's Jim again with your 90 seconds of wisdom. Still with a beard, looking pretty good right now, don't you think? So today's topic is renter's insurance. Why do I need renter's insurance? Well, it's the same reason that anybody needs any insurance, right? So you buy insurance because you're worried that the risk of something is greater than you're willing to bear on your own. And so think about that if you are a renter. You know, people, when they buy houses, they think, oh, my house burns down, I'll get a new house. That's why I have homeowner's insurance. Well, it's the same thing with renter's insurance, except you don't own the house, right? You just own the stuff inside. But the issue is, is that that can easily go away. So fire, flood, theft, uh, you know, an unscrupulous roommate or an idiot roommate who has, your, uh, has a party while you're out of town. If your stuff gets ruined, you're landlord's not going to pay for it even if the if the building burns down your landlord's insurance doesn't cover your contents only if you buy renter's insurance will it cover that renter's insurance is cheap you're talking about you know 10 bucks a month or something like that it's not very much and so it's totally worth it to make sure that your stuff which could include computers could include clothing all kinds of things is covered so that's why everyone should have either homeowner's insurance if you own a home or renter's insurance if you rent Okay, that's it. Bye.